in this tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to do this. Subscribe and hit the bell to get notified for more amazing tutorials that are yet to come. At first in your Filmora 9, go to the sample colors tab from here. Choose a white gradient and drag it into the timeline. Now go to the text tab and here into the title section. Choose any title you want to. I am using this one. Drag it into the timeline and then right click on the text and go to the properties. And now here in this advanced editor window, change the color of the text and then choose any font you want to. And then once everything is done, click OK. Now export this into a video. So now we have a white background with black text. And now to make a black background with white text, just simply here delete this white gradient. And click on the text and change its color to white from here. Now export this too with the best quality. Also a little tip, you can create multiple combination of different styles as per your liking like these. And now open the just render text video using the VLC media player. You can use any other you want to but I recommend using VLC media player because VLC has this special feature in which using this snippet function you can take a screenshot from the video. Now take a screenshot of this video and do that with the black background version too. And now import these screenshots of the VLC snippet that you have just taken. These screenshots can be found in the user's picture folder. Now after importing, choose any clip you want to, drag it into the main timeline and then drag the screenshot at above the main clip as a PIP. Now double click on it and here go into the compositing section and then choose a darken or multiply composition in case of a black background. Here you can see that our video is now inside the text. Now you can either increase or decrease the duration of the text image as it is a JPEG version. Now you can go here into the transform and scale this to any size. For now I am making it a little big. And now our effect is done. Also in case of a white background image, in the compositing section choose the screen composition instead of a darken or multiply. Also another tip, you can swap the positions of the clips by making the image text as the main clip and main video as a PIP. And as for the white background, another trick that can be done is to apply an overlay filter over it. As it is a white background, so the overlay will only affect the black text inside. It can be used to create awesome quick effects like this. And now you can export this into a video. So guys, what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile, then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos like this for you. Till then, see you later.